A new club inspired by Satan is stirring controversy in a local community. Parents and others are concerned about plans for an after school Satan club at an elementary school. Local 12's Morella Porter spoke with faith leaders and the club's organizers to get advice and a clearer picture of what parents can expect. The after school Satan club is unearthing an uproar. Parents across Lebanon skeptical of the intentions of the group with the hellish name. We don't believe in a literal Satan, um, but we do believe that Satan was the first to, you know, ask questions and stand up to tyrannical authority. Donovan Elementary will be the site of the country's second after school Satan club. Monthly meetings start next week, open to children, grades one through five. Social media making it clear a lot of people don't want the club here. Superintendent Isaac Seaver sending this letter to parents after approving the club's request to rent space at the school. Seaver's emphasizing the school district does not endorse the group or other religiously affiliated groups, explaining that public schools must allow all religious groups or none. The Good News Club, an evangelic program, has met after school at Donovan for years. June Everett, a minister of the Satanic Temple, tells me their club is an alternative to that. We do not believe in an actual devil. Um, we, in our clubs, we do not do any sort of rituals or devil worshiping or any kind of like sacrificing of goats, all the scary things that are kind of made up in people's heads. We simply are where kids can be kids, where they can interact with other children. Pastor Doug Sipsy doesn't buy it. He says even if they claim not to worship Satan, it doesn't sit right with him. It may look warm and fuzzy on the outside, but when you really get down to it, there is a culture of worshiping Satan here. He knows the school board is in a tough place. Pastor Anthony Wade agrees. He says people should use this as a way to be a light. Evil prevails when good men do nothing. And so I think that it's better for us to just not be so against things, uh, but be, let's be stronger of what we're for. In Lebanon, Morella Porter, Local 12 News. Well, last week, fewer than five students showed up at the club's first meeting in Moline, Illinois. Now, the Lebanon superintendent's letter can be found if you want to read it at our website, local12.com. 